So this was from the pivot. Uh, Bengals wide receivers were asked who was on their Mount Rushmore of defensive backs in the NFL. Here's their answer. Give me a Mount Rushmore. You don't got to go one right. through five. No order, but just, yeah. just give me some guys. Ooh, Mount Rushmore DBs. When you walking out there to play them, you know they're going to give you all hell. I just give you one. Denzel Ward off dunk. I think that's for all three of us. You know what I'm saying? Not just because Cleveland talked the most shit, but just because, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, Denzel Ward did his thing. You know what I'm saying? Same for Greg Newsom. I don't think he elite, but he definitely they all just talk crazy. So it ain't somebody we circling. It's, yeah, we see that. You up for Ain't even that. It's just no. It's, it's game time when we see him. It ain't, even, ain't no crunch up game. It's, it's on site. Like, yeah. It's, it's that. It's that. It's just on site when we see him. That's it. All right. Uh, again, the, the Browns are on the Mount Rushmore of uh, Bengals wide receivers. Denzel Ward saw that. Here's his answer to that on social media. Uh, definitely concerns me a little bit, you know what I mean? But, you know, I, I packed that thing too. So you come around this way, you will get caught. But Ryan is the running back. Fake it to him. Burrow has a target in sight, and it's stolen. It's stolen by Denzel Ward, who cuts back at the 40, and he may be going the distance. A full 100 yards to glory. And with that, let's welcome in Jacob Roach, Dog Pound Daily. Jacob, it is fun to have uh, elite wide receivers and elite defensive backs in the Browns and Bengals that will see each other twice each year. Uh, it should be fun on the field. I really enjoyed the reasoning, first off, about just the trash talk. I thought that was really just something I, I guess I didn't really think Dins, uh, uh, that Greg Newsom was much of a trash talker, so I thought that was really interesting to hear. But... Uh, yeah, I mean, Jamar Chase roasted everybody last year except for when he played the Browns. So, it, you know, it's a great matchup. I think it's going to be a great matchup again this year, and I'm really excited. It's just whenever you hear a dude like Chase, who's I probably think top five in the league, putting you on that list, both Ward and Newsom, it really tells you that it's not just us that think that the defensive backfield in Cleveland is elite. 